Greetings YouTube, welcome back to the channel. It's the case in the United States, and I'm guessing maybe throughout the world, where because New Year's Day fell on a weekend, they're having like a bank holiday today, so everything's kind of delayed a day. And I, I wonder if that's the case today. I wonder if the daily cards are just coming out today because, well, everything's been delayed a day. Well, what do you know? Kabam didn't want to make money yesterday, but they want to make money today. I want to also point out, this is so strange, in case you're wondering if this is just happening to you. Uh, I have just automatically earned all the points for Test of the Paragon, like, immediately, it felt like. Which, I'm used to that not even starting until noon. So, if you're like me and you're like, wait, I already did it? Because, like, you know, well, I don't know. Maybe it's because I took up a six-star. Maybe I just timed it right. Either way, it's been a crazy start to my 2023. But we've got daily cards available, and that's the point of this video. $30 for a daily card sounds reasonable. In fact, that is the cheapest we have seen a daily card, I think, ever? We're used to seeing a cheap daily card be 50 bucks, but we've seen $70 daily cards to end uh, 2023. So, or 2022, excuse me. 2023 hasn't ended. We're, we're two days in. Okay, so uh, you get 15,000 six star shards, which for 30 bucks uh, is $5 better than the 15,000 six star shards you get for being a Paragon player and cashing in seven daily card stamps. Um, Okay, so that's a good start. A six-star Nexus, in addition to that, is pretty exciting. The cheapest we've seen a six-star Nexus is about 30 bucks, but that's including the bonus units. And we saw that two years ago in the uh, Cyber Weekend sales of 2020, I think. But uh, but then Kabam decided that they were going to go away from that and only offer it for like 50 bucks. But how about not just that, also half a Tier 3 Alpha and half a Tier 6 Basic. That by itself is worth well over $30. Now, there's no gold attached to this offer. But, I mean, for the price, if Kabam had charged $50 bucks for this, I wouldn't hate it. But I love it for $30. Bucks. Look, the, pur the purpose of my channel, I know there are people who are always going to associate me with being negative. That's why I have the nickname Mr. Negative. But I just call myself Mr. Honest. Now, does that mean I'm right all the time? Of course not. When you make 11,000 videos on a YouTube channel, good luck being right in every one of those. But you do learn from your mistakes and hopefully do better with time. And I will like to think of myself as much better now than I was five years ago when I started this channel. Um, I think this is an A-plus offer. Now, obviously, this six-star Nexus is three randomized six-star champions, and not all six-star Nexus crystals are created equal. There are going to be people who buy this who maybe for the first time get six-star Quicksilver, for example, and just think that's the greatest thing ever. There are also going to be people who buy this who get a Groot, OG Captain America, and OG Daredevil and think that is truly disgusting luck. And disgusting and not in a good sense, but like literally in a wanna, I want to throw up sense. But in terms of guaranteed value, 15,000 six-star shards, Half a tier 3 alpha and half a tier 6 basic for 30 bucks is the best we have seen, especially because it's not Cyber Weekend or Cyber Week now. It's not July 4th. It's not spring cleaning. It's just a normal daily card to start off 2023. And it's kind of the opposite of inflation, you know? It's almost like deflation, which is encouraging. I do attribute this partially to the recognition that the daily cards have to go in line with the daily stamps because when you offer the top progression a cash back incentive for well at least 20 percent tier six basic tier three alpha 15,000 six star shards or especially when uh, we're going through this period that's almost over where battlegrounds is in like an off season six stones are harder to get because those can be pretty easily obtained with trophy tokens in the Battleground store, and they refresh at 50, I think, per week, every week. But regardless, this has forced Kabam to have to lower the prices of daily cards, but we haven't seen that 
really in practice too much until now. I am proud of Kabam for pricing something at a reasonable $30. I will be purchasing this as I buy basically every offer that I grade at an A or A+. Plus. And this is certainly an A to A+. Plus. Even if you get a horrible Nexus, I still think it's an A-. minus. But for the average summoner, it's at least a 95. I know the average summoner isn't Paragon, but you all at least have a lot of motivation to get to Paragon one day to see this kind of offer for cash. Happy New Year, everybody. Thanks for watching. Have a good one.